Trafalgar Square is um, you know a place where artists are invited to um, you know put put up public works of art. And so I was really thinking about the history of um, Trafalgar Square. Why is it called um, Trafalgar Square? And Nelson uh, won the battle of Trafalgar um, against Napoleon. Um, my um, generation in London, uh, multicultural London, is you know in a sense uh, a consequence of that uh, victory. So th that's uh, why I then decided to um, look at the battleship that um, Nelson won that battle uh, with. It is actually called HMS Victory. I decided to produce um, a replica of that ship, but then to put, to change the sails into African textiles. You know, there was a time when, um, you know, African people or African artists uh, were somehow trying to become part of the mainstream. Um, that's no longer the case. We actually make the mainstream. We define what that is. We are the children of um, independence. You know, most of most of us were born after the period of independence, uh, 1960. So we are now, in a way, um, the makers, if you like, of uh, global contemporary culture. And London is a dynamic center for that. The fourth plinth um, is about celebrating and promoting the best of contemporary visual culture. It's about generating debate, getting people talking about public art, and also critically, it's about taking public art and contemporary art out of a confined gallery space and into the public realm. People really feel that they kind of own it, it's theirs, they talk about it, they hate it, they love it, and that's all part of the programme. We all loved Yinka's proposal since the moment the box arrived on my desk and we opened up his drawings to reveal his kind of magical idea. I think the other thing about it is it is a wonderful kind of evolution of Yinka's work today. He spent quite a lot of time, as you'll know, exploring colonialism, post-colonialism and also it is the 50th anniversary of Nigerian independence so it's really fortuitous that it's happening in this year. We're delighted to announce today that the piece will be unveiled on Monday the 24th of May. Well the Antrust Bank has always been an avid supporter you know, of the arts. You know, it's something that we've been, we're known for in Nigeria and we're also developing that reputation even internationally. It's the first time you know, that um, a black artist it's been showcased you know, the fourth plant. Uh, secondly, it's a momentous you know, time in our own history, in the history of Nigeria, you know, where we originally come from. This year will mark you know, the 50th you know, anniversary of Nigeria's independence. And also of particular significance for Granted Trust Bank is that this year is uh, marking the 20th anniversary of the formation you know, of the bank. It's, it's a good opportunity to also showcase what we as an organization are all about while sponsoring you know, the development and the showcasing of um, black art. You know, it's a secret, I won't really um, say how the ship gets into the bottle, you know, that's something I want people to wonder about.